Psycho mass killers, we blast and clap triggers and laugh and smash bitches Harassed by fast bitches, obsessed with cash getting possessed by rap spitting Had dreams of fast living, but in my dreams it seems I'm seeing demons before me And when they got me, they tore me, your sniper shot me, ignore me If you don't like me, inform me, watch how quick it gets stormy Watch the bitches get horny, sick and twisted like Barney They should oppress and kill her hardly, why she's licking me bizarrely When I'm sick and it is hard, if it's missing that shit is hard It's gonna show you where it's hard, it's get that buzz all started Then that double What's up, homie? What the fuck is wrong with you this morning? Had another nightmare. It's cause all that fucked up shit you be doing at that lab. My job's got nothing to do with it. Whatever, nigga. And it's them little animals you be fucking with. I think God giving you a warning. Man, shut up. And where were you last night? I was out. Out where, smartass? None of your business. You ain't my daddy. Yeah? Well, Pops ain't here, is he? And the course say you gotta do what I tell you to do until you're 18. Man, I gotta go. I'm about to be late. Come right back here after school. We need to talk about your friends. My friends? So, so what, you got some shit to say about them? Yeah, I don't like you hanging around them too much. Man, you can't tell me who to be friends with. I just did. Now you better be here when I get back. Don't make me come looking for you. What the hell are you doing? Having some breakfast. Learning about Cuba. What? Nothing. I was, I was just kidding. I was just having some breakfast. Where the hell's Rick? Um, he went to the taco truck store this morning. Ran out of here clutching his stomach. Um, I assume he's gonna take a sick one. Well, hurry up and get started. I expect to see positive results on the regenerate formula by the end of the month. Okay. Sure thing, Mr. Richards. Doctor. Doctor Dickhead. Beautiful. I'm 
at the point to where it's all bad and I really don't give a fuck And everybody's shady lately, basically it all sucks These dirty crackheads and hookers plaguing city streets Ain't good for nothing but some maids and falling six feet These politicians make this ghetto what it is today I like to round them bitches up and blow their ass away Man, ain't nobody on this earth gon' give a fuck about me So I'ma drop it like a key and ball regardless, homie Keep the sap L's for me and my folks Staying wasted doing a hundred, blowing halos of bomb smoke Choke on the truth, we in apocalypse right now Everybody blasting, someone throw me in the white towel It's over with, the whole planet done gone berserk Fuck it, burn the whole thing to ashes and dirt It's a lost world, come to the jungle, get made a. Put a 50 to your chest plate and watch it get contact See, I was broke with a youngster I sported pro wings and rustlers I hated to suffer, so me and my brother Turned into hustlers, while other suckers Were getting high and doing stupid shit Me and my brother were scheming to get up out this bitch This bitch I speak about, the ghetto, the streets, the hood life Drug dealing, drug using, homies trying to earn stripes The hood life ain't no joke, man The ghetto try to kill me Unless you've been in my shoes, how can you feel me? Boot stamps, free cheese, secondhand clothes and wick Top ramen, powder milk, totaling kicks, generic labels Deviled ham on the dinner table, looking bummy No money, black and white TV with stolen cable This ain't no fable, the story I speak is factual Police don't give a fuck, they treat us all like animals Acting a fool as a youth, but I'm mature real quick Cause reality slap my fantasies like a bitch Nobody knows me, I came up from nothing homie, I raised myself a motherfucking hustling only, my oldie told me to always speak boldly, so every day my life I'm yelling fuck the police, can't stand the beast, they got us on our fucking knees, still love my country for giving me them blocks of cheese, Dickies crease, sport the polo top from big and fat, since 79 the A's cap, grew up in the haystack. Thought I told you to wait until I got here. I couldn't wait any longer. Dr. Dickhead came here and started bitching. Said he wants the results by the end of the month. By the end of the month? How many times do I have to talk to this guy? I already told him you can't rush progress. We're under enough pressure as it is with Peter calling us murderers every day. Yeah, murderers. We kill some filthy little rat so that some rich bitch can have her poodle back. Yeah. Remember all that shit they gave this company about the rumors that we were cloning animals? Yep. Every time we start something new, it brings out the tree huggers. And those are the same assholes that use every product that people like us create. Alright. Enough of this bullshit. Let's get to work. I gotta get out of here on time today. How the fuck you didn't even start on time? You didn't tell Richards that, did you? No. I told him you were in the shitter. Good. Last thing I need is that fool saying I'm slacking off after my raise. So, uh, what are we gonna do tonight, man? What's the plan? Nothing, man. I gotta get up out of here in like 15 minutes, though. Why, man? Where you going? I gotta get to the house before my brother get there. You know he wanna bitch at me about something. Hell no, nah, man. I fool think he your dad again. I know, man. And it's getting worse. He always talking about what I'm gonna do with my life. And he talking about how we gotta watch out for each other since our parents died. Man, just cause that fool getting old on me, you gotta get it all with him, dog. That's uh, real. That's what I'm saying, too, though. That fool just needs to get some pussy, dude. That's it. Pussy makes everything better, dude. How would you know, Virgin? <laughs> Shut the fuck up, fool. I, f I fucked before your ass did, so shut the fuck up. Man, your cousin don't call you nasty, motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> Why you gotta go there, man? <laughs> hey. Hey, motherfucker, you call the cops on me? Somebody call the police on your bitch ass. I know it had to be you or your faggot ass brother. The cops came and raided my house for weed. I know it had to be one of y'all scary bitches. You got raided cause you was a sucker, punk. Slanging out in the open with them white boys and shit. That's why you got raided. Lying ass bitch. Man, give me that fucking bat. Hey, hold on. Hey, step the fuck back, fool. You don't wanna see me. Why the fuck you gotta pull out a gun, punk? Fool, you should've pulled out a bat. Should've let your girl over there get his ass beat like a man. Fuck that shit. All right, I see you motherfuckers around. I ain't finished with you yet. You best believe you'll be seeing me around, punk. Man, all y'all better get up out of here, man, for y'all get whooped. Punk-ass motherfucker, let's go. 
kick rocks, nigga, before you get stopped. Mark ass bitches. Yo, man, I'm serious about tonight, man. Met some fine ass freak at the mall yesterday. What? Met some friends too, she wants to kick it. So I set it all up for the night. Where are they from? Frisco. Shit, they got ass too. What? How you know? Shit, my folks showed me a picture. Pretty fucking fine, man. So you gonna come up with a plan or what, man? Man, it sound good, y'all, but my brother, he be tripping. Oh, and plus, man. I don't think I could be going all the way to Frisco tonight. Dude, man. I ain't even gonna kick it in Frisco either. Man, I don't even trip, cuz. They got a car and they're gonna meet us at Marco's house. Three of us? Three of them? All of them notches, man. Sound good, y'all. But I'm gonna have to holler at y'all later about that, man. Oh, cuz, man. Hey, y'all should get going too. This nigga might start flashing, man. Oh, shit, man. All right, then, cuz. All right, man. Yeah, for sure. Hit me All up, right. man. Come see me. Call me later, man. Okay. Don't forget, man. All right. It's for the report. You. Bay Area. Kill me! I already died in the. Well, I thought you said you wanted to talk to me. Later. I've had a long day. <sighs> Whatever. Nobody move, it's a robbery! Man, we should have just got pizza. You want pizza every night? Well, you cook the same shit every night. Yeah? Well, why don't you cook? I like mac and cheese. I mean, so do I. But it's either this shit or a frozen dinner. What's wrong with a frozen dinner? You get meat, vegetables, and a dessert? Nice square meal. So what did you want to talk to me about tonight, man? My partners? Well, kind of, sort of, but that's not all. Well, you need to stop tripping on them, man. Them is my partners. They have my back today. Had your back? What type of bullshit are you getting into? Man, some suckers just tried to start some shit today at the park while we was playing hoop. That's exactly why I've decided we're moving out of Oakland. What? And when was you gonna tell me? I'm trying to tell you now. Well, where? Out of Oakland. Out of Oakland. But where to, man? The Burbs. What city? Castro Valley. Castro Valley? I heard they got the clan there. I don't give a fuck what they got. I'll tell you what they don't got. They don't have crackheads running their streets, or drug dealers selling dope to kids, or a hundred fucking murders every year. Man, I heard that whole town was full of crackers. Well, maybe we can add a little color there. So when are we supposed to be leaving? Well, I've been saving up for a while now. My rage just came through, so I say in about a month. Man, then I'm going out tonight. You might as well. You won't be seeing your friends too much in a month, and I'm going out with Josie tonight anyway. Josie? Yes. Oh, that's why we moving to Castro Valley. You done let this white girl poison you. Man, this is some crazy shit. Yeah, but it's gonna be a good change. So where are you going tonight and with who? Marco and Kev lined up some hoes for us tonight. We're gonna take him to Jack London, to the movies, or to eat. You just ate? Man, I'm talking about real food. I only got one life to live. I only got four dollars in my pocket and no place to live. But I still got that. What's the verdict? Yeah, I'll be there in like 10 minutes. Oh, he's letting you go? Yeah. How come you don't sound too happy about that? It's just some other fucked up shit. I'll tell you about it when I get there. Alright then. Alright. I'll be back by midnight. No, no, no. 11, alright? Alright. 
Eleven is cool. Nope. But can I get twenty dollars? Thanks. Be careful, all right? All right, I will. We offer the services to Let them know a little bit about what we do. That way, when I talk to brother, I don't have to repeat myself again. Yeah, what's up? Listen, I need you to do exactly what I tell you to do and don't ask me any fucking questions. Okay. I need you to bring me a full vial of the formula right now to the house right now. What? The cell regenerate? Yes, the formula! Hurry the fuck up, he's dying! What? Who's dying? <laughs> word of me unless you're gonna help me. We wanted to see if this shit works, now we will. Why don't you just call 911? Fuck 911! He's already dead! This shit is his only chance! Check him again. No. Oh, shit. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay, okay. Okay. 
Check him again. No both. Fuck. And one, and two, and three, and four, and five. Rick, he's dead. Man. No, he's not. He's dead, man. You need to let him go. No! Hey, three, he's dead! No! You need to let him go! No! No! He's gone. <laughs> <laughs> gotta let him go. <laughs> Sorry. You're calling 911, bro. Go ahead, boys, take him away. Ready? Lip. I know this is a tough situation, sir. And I'm sorry for your loss. And I need to ask you some questions. What exactly went on here? I was sitting here on the couch watching TV. And then my brother just left out the door. All right. Make sure you got him strapped in real good in there, okay? I just have a few more questions for you, sir. Okay. So what happened to your brother when he walked outside? I heard gunshots. I ran outside. And then I saw him laying there dead. So then I picked him up and dragged him back into the house. And he helped me perform CPR. And you were here the whole time too? Uh, yeah. But you didn't see the car? No. And you shot him his bed off. If anybody would have seen the car, it would have been me, but I didn't see anything. Did he have any enemies or anyone you may think might be responsible for this, sir? None that I know of. I mean, he was a good kid. Maybe a few high school views here and there. But nothing major. We were moving out of Oakland at the end of the month. What about his friends? What about them? Did you know them? Any problems there? No. I didn't really know them too much. I'm going to need their names and addresses if you have them. I just know their names. Don't know where they live, but they live close. Um, Kevin Whitmore and Marco Dotel. That's good enough, sir. So then what happened? Well, we were doing CPR, and then it wasn't working, so then I called 911. Okay, I'm gonna need you to sign the statement, sir. <clears throat> Again, I'm terribly sorry for your loss. We're gonna do everything in our power to catch perpetrators. You could probably have your brother transferred to the funeral home tomorrow after the coroner looks at him. We'll let you know, sir. Thank you, officer. If you could think of anything else, give me a call. It would help the case very much. Thank you, officer. Yeah, thank you. No problem. Hey, Tom, and me and Johnny, we're heading on in. Dude, you should see this kid. I mean, he is all fucked up. He must have pissed somebody off real bad. Well, that's just fucking great. Robinson's a fucking M.E. tonight, so he'll be pissed. I brought him two car crashes yesterday, you know what I'm saying? Hey, you should have worked last Friday. Three fucking murders within two hours of each other. Man, they had me and Johnny driving all over Oakland that night. Yeah, I saw it on the 10 o'clock news. I was happy as hell that was my weekend off. 
fucking drug dealers and gangbangers. Hey man, just keep in mind those drug dealers and gangbangers, if it wasn't for them, you and I wouldn't have a job. Man, ain't that the truth. Hey, you working this weekend? Unfortunately, I don't have another weekend off till next month, but I couldn't. God ah, damn, out. hold on a second. What the fuck? Hey Johnny, what's going on back there? Can you get that for me? Sure. Yeah, is Rick here? Uh, hold on. He has some kids at the door. Let them in. All right, come on in. Jermaine's friends. I'm Marco and this is Kevin. I see. Know who you are. The cops came by and told us what happened, man. I, I can't believe it. Jermaine was one of our best friends and we just wanted to come by and give you our condolences. Sorry. I'm sorry too. Sorry it didn't get us out of Oakland a month sooner. We think we know who did it. What? Who? Well, we got into some funk earlier this afternoon. Some fool named Julio and his friends. He said you sick the cops on him, so he had it out for your brother. That little drug dealer? He tried to sell meth to my neighbor's 12 year old. Hell yeah, I called the cops on that son of a bitch. That's what probably got your brother shot, man. So where's the son of a bitch at? You think he's home? Huh? Probably not. He's probably hiding somewhere if he's the one that did this. Well, we think we know where he hangs out all the time. Why? Think about doing something? Yeah. I want to take his life. Like he took my brother's life. What? Are you out of your fucking mind? First you had me lie to the cops, you had me steal from work, and now you're talking about killing some fucking kids. Not kids. Criminals. I'm not gonna help you kill some kids. Why don't you call the cops and let them handle this? Fuck the cops! I'm not letting those motherfuckers get away with this. You don't have to. We'll take care of them if you want us to. Hell yeah, just give us the word. Shit. Well, I'm sorry. I don't want any part of this. Look, look, just calm down. I don't know what I'm going to do yet. Can you find out where he's at and come back and let me know? You don't even know if he did this. I know he did this. He threatened all of us earlier at the park. Dude got right up in Jermaine's face. Yeah, we'll go find out where those fools at. We'll be right back. I'd appreciate it. And don't do anything, just come back and let me know. I'll figure out what to do. I don't want to involve you two in this. And Jermaine was our homie. We are involved. Man, I'm out of here, Rick. You know, I'm sorry about what happened, but I don't want any part of this shit. None of it. We'll be right back.
Hey, you guys think the pigs are looking for us? Man, fuck the cops. We got rid of the guns we used, did that shit quick as fuck, and it's nighttime, fool. Ain't nobody seen us. Quit being paranoid. It's not about being paranoid. I'm just looking out for us. Whatever, man. I ain't tripping off shit. Man, fuck the cops. Fuck Jermaine. Most of all, fuck his brother. Police call him motherfucker. What if he comes looking for some payback? Then we fuck that fool up too. I don't care, shit. Quit tripping, Damon. Ain't nothing gonna happen. Ah! Yo, what the fuck, man? What the fuck? <laughs> We killed him! We killed him! Get the fuck out of here! Oh, fuck, Kevin, look! It's Jermaine! What the f- Jermaine! Jermaine! Oh, fuck! Oh, fuck, he's coming! What just happened? This motherfucker bit me! He fucking ate Damon! Then he bit me! We fucking killed him! You saw? We shot the fuck out of him! No one could survive that! No one! He was all fucked up! He wasn't alive! You saw the bullet holes? He was already dead! Man, if I didn't see what I just saw in my own two eyes, I swear, man, I'd be fucking going crazy! Yo! How's your hand, man? It hurts like a motherfucker! The fuck are we gonna do? Go to the police? And tell them what? That the motherfucker we just killed a few hours ago was eating our friend alive? I don't know, man. Fuck! My hand is killing me! Feels like I got acid in my veins. How the fuck do you think this happened? Maybe, maybe his brother practiced voodoo. How the fuck should I know? I'm serious, motherfucker! I'm serious too! How the fuck you explain a dead motherfucker walking around eating people alive? Jermaine's alive! Jermaine's alive, bro! What? He's fucking dead, man, but he's fucking alive! What the hell are you talking about? Man, dude, he's all fucked up, man, but he's walking around eating one of those motherfuckers at the park! Wait, hold on, hold on! Slow down! and tell me exactly what happened at the park. We drove by to see if those fucking punks was there. When we got there, Julio and fucking Adriel was running and screaming to the car. Yeah, they jumped in the car and they fucking mashed out. And we saw Jermaine oh, fuck, fucked up man. and bloody, man. He was eating Damon alive, taking bites out of that motherfucker. Fucking chunks! And he looked at us and started growling like a fucking dog. Viciously! And he came after us, and we took off. Now we're here. It worked. What worked? Shut the fuck up. Hello? It's me. It worked. It worked. What worked? The formula. What the fuck are you talking about? I need your help. Jermaine's alive. Dude, you gotta let it go. Jermaine's gone, man. I'm serious, Scott. His friends just ran into the house and told me they saw him attacking one of the kids that killed him. The cell regenerate worked. You sure they're not fucking with you? There's only one way to find that out. Now get your ass over here and help me find him before he kills somebody else. Bullshit. I'm not helping you anymore. I'm not even involved in this. Well, sorry, Scott. You're already involved in this. And for every person that he kills, it's our fault. Now get your ass over here. Fuck. Hurry, motherfucker. This is gonna hurt a little bit. Just do it. You right? Yo, yo, what the fuck? Yo, what the fuck? What the fuck's wrong with you? Hey, I'm going to sleep. Get up. Get up. Fuck. Hey, you're bleeding from your nose. 
Hey, hey, are you right? Hey, wake up! Hey, hey, don't close your eyes, wake up! Hey, snap out of it, come on, look at me! Right here, look at me! Talk to me, man, talk to me, come on! No, no, the fuck is happening? The fuck is going on? Got here as fast as I could. What's going on? They went to the park to find those assholes. What they saw was Jermaine eating one of them while the other two ran for their lives. Eating? Eating. You guys saw his dead brother eating another person. Eating. Yeah. Eating them. Biting and fucking taking chunks out of them. Eating them like a fucking dog. Jesus, the fucking formula. That's what I've been trying to tell you. Well, did he say anything? No. He just kept growling. And then he came after us. And what did you do? The fuck do you think we did? We fucking ran for our lives too. Well, did he recognize you? Was he even coherent? No. Why would he attack his own friends? It was Jermaine's body. But it wasn't Jermaine inside. It was a fucking monster. <sighs> Sounded like Jermaine had a lot of strength to be able to fight off three guys and kill one of them. Well, maybe the double dose of the formula increased the cell regeneration at an alarming rate. What is this formula you guys keep talking about? We're working on a cell regeneration formula back at the lab. It's supposed to bring sick animals back to health. And eventually, years and years from now, humans regenerate the dead cells. Understand? We've never tried it on anything but fucking rats and mice. But when my brother got shot, all I could think about was how I failed him. How I failed my parents. He's the only thing I have left of my family. Well, what do you want to do now, Ricky? We gotta stop him. Well, no shit. How? I don't know. Why don't we just call the police? Let them handle this. So we could go to prison? Ruin our careers? Not to mention the company we work for. We gotta stop him from hurting anyone else. We gotta capture him and take him to the lab and run some tests. This is your brother we're talking about. Exactly. I need to help him. All right, fuck it. Kevin, you come with us. Show us where the park is. Marco, you stay here in case Jermaine comes back. Let's go. This can't be happening. The fuck am I gonna do? The fuck am I gonna do? Oh my god. Adriel! Adriel! Hold on, man, I need help. Fuck. Come on! 911 emergency. What is your emergency? My friend! He's been bit! He's on the truck shaking! Calm down, sir. Do you know what bit him? A dead person! Excuse me, sir? A zombie! A fucking zombie! <laughs> sir, these types of calls are illegal. 911 is not a joke. If you do this again, I'll be forced to send officers to come talk to your parents. Goodbye. Kevin? Yeah? You stay in the car. Last thing I need is for you to get hurt, too. Yeah, I'm gonna leave the keys in the car. If anything happens to us, just take off and get the cops. Hell yeah! I said it was next to the bleachers. I don't see shit. Yeah, but look at all the blood. Well, where's the body? How the fuck should I know? Maybe he ate them whole. That's impossible, Scott. That's being sarcastic. Just keep your eyes open. I'm gonna take a closer look. This is a dead end, man. Let's get the fuck out of here. Yeah, probably right. They're probably long gone by now. Still alive. 
Fuck you, you go see if he's still alive. Just do it! You're the one with the gun! Fuck the pussy. He's dead. Are you sure? Yeah. So where the fuck did you get that gun? From our closet. This is Oakland. I thought it would come in handy someday. You know, if Jermaine transferred the cell regenerant to this dead fuck, it's contagious. No fucking shit. If it gets into anyone's bloodstream, it pumps right to the heart and starts regenerating. So where's Jermaine? Probably in the bushes. Kevin! Pull him up, Kevin! Pull him up, Kevin! Where the hell are we going now? Julio's house. What for? If Jermaine had the intellect to find those fags at the park, then he has the intellect to go after them at Julio's house. Well, how the hell are we going to find his house? I'll call Marco and get directions. Well, you better tell him to get the fuck out of your house before Jermaine gets to him. We left that poor kid defenseless. Yeah, you're right. What the fuck happened? We found two of those things at the park. One of them attacked us, the other one got Kevin. Kevin's dead? Yes. Oh my god. Oh my god. Look, calm down. I need you to give me Julio's address and then get the fuck out of the house. You sure you don't need my help? Not right now. Just get the fuck out of the house. You're defenseless. We'll call you if we need you. Alright man, you're right. Now how do we get to Julio's? So are you sure you want to go there? We have to. If they attack more people, we're fucked. So what if we find some in there? What are we going to do? We take them out. We kill them. Yeah, that's easy for you to say. You're the one with the gun. Just stay next to me, I'll cover us. What about Jermaine? I would appreciate if we could take him without killing him. You're fucking crazy, man. I think we need to kill him before he kills us. I don't give a fuck what you think. That's my brother. I don't want to kill him. You're gonna get us killed, man. I'm telling you. Look, it's my fault he's like that. I'm gonna help him and I don't want to hurt him unless we have to. And I'm not gonna let him hurt us. Obviously, he remembers certain things. I don't think he's gonna hurt us. Why the fuck did he attack his friends? I don't know. I just don't know. Let's do this. It's 
stay close. If you see anything, scream. Oh, I will. Look at the blood! <sighs> this doesn't look good. Are we gonna follow it? Of course. Come on. We're too late. He's already gotten to... Now we're gonna need to worry about more than two zombies. Two more. Maybe even three. He could've turned the whole fucking family for all we know. Fuck. What are we gonna do? Where would Jimin go? He could go to our house. Marco's house, Kevin's house, I don't know. Ricky, we're gonna need help. It's time to call somebody. Shit's gotten out of hand. I already told you I'm not calling the fucking cops. I wasn't talking about the cops. I think we should call Dr. Dickhead. Richards? You wanna call the fucking bus? Are you out of your mind so we can lose our jobs? It's better than going to prison. Besides, he can't fire us when we can expose him. First of all, he'll be happy that the formula works. Almost works. Well, yeah, almost works. Second of all, he can't risk the government shutting him down if the public finds out. He won't risk losing millions. He'll know what to do. I'm sure he's got connections. I don't know, man. Sounds like a good idea, but... Remember how that whistleblower disappeared? I don't trust that man. I don't trust him either. But we're not whistleblowers. We're loyal employees that know a lot of his secrets. The two of us and that one gun can't fix this by ourselves. Call him. Call him. Hello? Dr. Richards? This is Ricky. Hey, good evening, Rick. What can I do for you? Well, I've got some good news for you and some bad news for you. I'm going to tell you the good news first because the bad news is pretty fucked up. I see. G go ahead. Well, you know how hard me and Scott have been working at the lab. Yeah? We finally got the cell regenerate formula working. You're kidding me. That's great news. So have you tried it on a living subject? Not exactly, sir. We tried it on a recently deceased subject and it seems to have brought back life. What? Are you sure about this? Positive. Dead cells regenerated and brought back life. Dr. Richards? Yes, I'm, I'm still here. Are you okay, sir? <laughs> yes, this is the most amazing news I heard in my life. <sighs> this will advance us years ahead of everyone else. Hold on, Dr. Richards. Don't get ahead of yourself. So, so what did you try it on? One of the rats? One of the mice? <sighs> no, sir. Bigger. A cat? A dog? Um... A human. What? Say again? A human, sir. I said a human. Why in the hell would you do such a thing? Who? How? Earlier this evening, my brother was shot to death in a drive-by. 
Me and Scott injected him within minutes of his death. It didn't seem to work at first, but I refused to give up. So then I gave him a second dose and still nothing. So we gave up and called 911. They carted him away. And here's where the bad news comes. What happened? Long story short, he came back to life, only he's not the same. He's attacking people like a rabid animal, and he's loose on the streets. Oh, good God. Wait, Dr. Richards, that's not the worst of it. The cell regenerate seems to have mutated on its own, and anyone he bites, he transfers the cell regenerate into their bloodstream, and that person becomes infected. How many people, Rick? As far as I know, just three. Two at the park, and one down the street from us. But I took care of one of them at the park. The other one got away. You have to shoot them in the heart to stop them. Why the fuck did you wait so long to get in contact with me? I thought I could take care of the problem myself. I'm sorry. So how many more do you think are out there? I think just two. Plus my brother Jermaine. I have reason to believe they're headed back to my house. <sighs> Alright. I'll see you there in 15 minutes. Are you bringing some help? You better fucking believe it. And Rick, not a word to anyone. Ricky! State your business. Romero, this is Dr. Richards. I'll be needing your services again. When? Now. So soon? Right now. It's gonna cost you. <sighs> double. I was gonna pay you double anyway. I have a huge bitch of a problem that we need to take care of. Fast. Not a problem. Good. I'll be there in five. Hey, come another cousin, hold on. Hey, fool. Take care of that court fine already? Hell no, man. You know how to fix my motherfucking bucket? Stupid, man. You know they're gonna throw your ass in county. Man, fuck the county. I'd rather do 15 days in county and let them motherfuckers have my money. Stupid, man. Why am I gonna bitch about having a bed, three full meals, kicking back watching cable? Might be even better than the projects, homie. Shit, homie, you crazy. Fuck the county, man. Fucking hate the county. I ain't even tripping, homie. Hey, who's that crazy looking motherfucker right there? I don't know, it's Jackie's ass, homie. Or what the? <laughs> what the fuck? Hold on. Deja fucking boo. It's that park zombie again. Now's your second chance to kill him. Once and for all. Aim for the heart, Rick. Aim for the heart. Don't worry. Don't 
뭐야? Somebody's been here. How do you know? Because why the hell would Marco leave the front door open? Fuck this, cock your gun. It's already cocked, let's go. Should we call Richards? We gotta make sure the house is safe first before anybody gets here. You coming? Hell yeah, I'm not seeing the car with a fucking dead body. Let's go. Starting to turn. Shoot her ass! Now! Now! Pick up the body, put him in my trunk, and we'll board him at the lab. Hurry up, let's go inside before somebody sees something. Jesus Christ. Who the fuck is she? That was my girlfriend. She started to turn, so I had to take her out. <sighs> well, it's another one we gotta put in my trunk. Rick, this is my friend Romero. Romero, this is Rick and Scott. They work at my lab. So you're the ones responsible for this, huh? So who the hell are you, pal? He's ex-military. He gets paid well to clean up messes. You're a merc? What the fuck's a merc? Mercenary. My cousin's ex-military. He's a paid merc. Something like that. Well, it's good to have you with us. We could use another gun. So how many more do you think are out there? I have no idea. At least two more. What the fuck are we doing in here? Let's get out there and clean this fucking mess. 
What we need to do is sit here and calmly decide what's the best scenario. We know she was your lady. Who the fuck was the kid outside? Two of my brother's friends were helping us. We left one here in case my brother came back. The one outside took us to a park to show us where they were attacked. While we were there, we were attacked by one of those things. We killed him. That's when he got attacked. So what happened to the kid that you left waiting here? I think he's okay. We told him to go home earlier after we left the park. Do you think? Or do you know? I can call him. Why? This kid obviously knows the neighborhood. He can help us find the others. Besides, he knows too much. We can't have him run his mouth about what he's seen. I'm not letting you kill a fucking kid. I'm not gonna kill him. I just wanna keep him quiet. I just wanna talk to him. So what's the plan? All right, Rick, you come with me. We'll take my car. Romero, you go with Scott and pick up that kid. And we'll keep in touch. I don't like this. And if any of you get bit, I won't hesitate to shoot you. Pick up the girl, put her in my trunk. Come on, let's go. Late, babe? Well, yeah, I mean, it's only Lake Merritt. I mean, why are you tripping? Well, it's Oakland and the middle of the night. <laughs> you know, you said you wanted to go to someplace romantic. I mean, what could be more romantic than this? I mean, check it out. You got the city lights looking across a lake, trees all around us. Look up at the sky. The stars are shining on us. And then there's me. I mean, what could be more romantic than that? What if a homeless person comes and bothers us? Ooh, or a dope fiend. You really think some fucking tweaker dope fiend is gonna come over here messing with us right now? I mean, you know I'll break their fucking neck. Uh, well, I've heard there's gangs that stay in this area. Aren't there gangs in this neighborhood? There's gangs everywhere, but here, really it's mostly just dope dealers and they pretty much kill themselves off. And besides that, we're not black. We'll be okay. And if your thing does go down, guess what? I'm packing. Your what? Oh yeah. Baby, you know me. I always come prepared, baby. Oh yeah, but what if he comes at you with a gun or something? Then what are you gonna do? You know, you've gotta worry about everything right now. I guess you just wanna fucking go back to boring ass no, Alameda. No, no, babe, 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 babe. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I, I was just asking questions. Come here. And besides, Alameda is not boring. Hello? Marco, is this you? Yeah, who the fuck is this? It's Scott, Ricky's lab partner. Oh, what's up, man? Is everything all right? No, fuck no. What happened? This shit's gotten way out of hand. We're on our way to pick you up. Who the fuck is we? I've got some help. Some professional help. We just need you to take his places where we can find Jermaine or Julio. Yeah, man. No problem. Good. Now how the fuck do I get to your house? Got a fucking problem here, junkie? Hey, asshole. I'm talking to you, man. Let's just go. Let's go. Oh, Let's fuck go. this pervert, man. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's fuck go. that Let's shit. Go. Fuck that pervert. You want a problem? We got one. So what the hell are we gonna do now? 
Just keep your eyes open for any fucking thing that looks out of the ordinary. Oh! Oh, like some bitch screaming and running away from something? Where? Back there, man! Flip a bitch! Are we gonna stop her? No, just keep going to what she was running from. Right there, right there, right there. Help me dump the bodies in the lake. Get the fuck out of here before the cops come. Fuck. I can't believe this mess you made for me. It wasn't my intention. I was just trying to save my brother. If this gets out, I'm ruined. We'll both be fucked. We'll both go to jail. Yeah, but if we capture all of the infected and get back to the lab, me and Scott could tweak the formula a bit and see what went wrong. It'll be the biggest scientific breakthrough in history. But if we fail, then we'll be the biggest scientific horror story in history. They can make a movie out of this shit while we rot in prison. <sighs> Just keep your eyes open. What's up? We found Julio and some fucking kid that he bit. We took care of both of them and dumped them at the lake. Are you alright? Yeah, me and Marco are fine. But Romero got bit. Yeah, he looks like shit. Fuck. What about you guys? Why are you breathing so heavy? We got into it with two crazy motherfuckers. You know them? No. But either Jermaine or Julio got to these two. One of them almost bit Richards, but I got him at the last second. Well, it couldn't have been Julio. This fucker was all the way at the lake. We still haven't found Jermaine. I have reason to believe they're headed back to my house. What makes you say that? Because I found these fools two blocks from my house. So what now? Meet me at my house. All right. And Scott. Yeah. Watch your ass. Romero could turn. I know. Marco's watching him right now. So what happened? <coughs> What'd he say? Well, they got Julio on some fool that he bit, so that's good. <coughs> Hell yeah, that's good. Now we just gotta worry about Jermaine. If he didn't bite anybody else, like these two. Yeah. Oh, and Romero got bit, but he's still alive. They're meeting us back at the house right now. Fuck. You can say that again. So what do we do about these two? <coughs> Fuck them, just leave them as they lay. What about the cops? <coughs> what about them? Let's get the fuck out of here. Good idea. <coughs> hey, so, now that all this shit happened, man, how the fuck do you feel about the shit you and Rick do? I feel shit. If it wasn't for guys like us, there never would have been aspirin or penicillin. 
or any other modern medicine today. Yeah, still, man, but look what the fuck you guys did to Jermaine. I didn't do shit to Jermaine. That was Rick. He knew the formula wasn't ready. Besides, that was his brother. I can't blame him. Can you? I guess not. So what the fuck is the formula, man? It's a cell regenerate. Supposed to be used on sick animals. Makes dead cells healthy again. We never intended to use it on humans until years and years from now. It's not intended to be used on dead tissue either. Only sick and healthy living tissue. How come he hasn't turned yet? I don't know. Maybe it works differently when you're alive. He was only bit. The others had been dead. Maybe it won't do anything. Maybe just make him sick. That's why I didn't shoot him back at the lake. Nauseous. I think I might have swallowed some blood. <coughs> Alright, let's go inside real quick. Alright. <coughs> Yo, man. Let me check the house first. I just need to relax. Just sit there. <coughs> Let me look around first. so good. Why don't you try vomiting? Good idea. Where's your bathroom? It's right there, man. You want some water? Yeah, please. <coughs> Make it a tall glass. <coughs> a lot of ice. What's your thing? What is he saying? I don't know, man. I don't believe that. I don't understand shit. Hold on, man. We're almost there. Almost there. Hey, man, you all right? Yo. Yo. What the fuck? Hey, man. Pull over, man. What for? We're almost there. Dude. I think this fool stopped breathing. Fuck. Hey. Hey. Check if he's breathing. Fuck. I think he's dead. What the fuck do we do, man? Do I shoot him? I, I don't know. Let's just get out of the car.
the fuck do we fucking shoot him? Wait a second. Let's fucking shoot him! Shut the fuck up! Let's make sure! He might not turn. <sighs> fucking told you! Shut the fuck up! Get in the car! Dr. Richards, I got you some water. Dr. Richards, are you all right? me. 